hello guys how are you doing today trust that you're doing great if you're here on my channel for the first time thank you for joining me here on my channel please leave me your name and your location i'd love to connect with you and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back to my channel today guys i'll be sharing with you some schools in the united states that are waiving application fees some are waiving gre yeah, I'll be sharing all of that with you today. You know, having all of these waivers is one of the opportunities for you to lower your cost of studying in the United States as an international student. Because if you had to write GRE, the cost is like over $200. But if you can apply to a school and get admitted and even get funding without having to uh, incur that expense, I think that is a good deal. So stay with me today as I'll be sharing these schools with you. If you are yet to subscribe to my channel, guys, please go ahead to hit the subscribe button the subscribe button is the red button you can find on the screen and right next to it is the bell icon kindly hit that as well so that you will be part of my notification gang and you would be part of the first to know whenever i share new videos guys you know that this is application season so schools are already taking applications for next year fall already some are still open for spring 2023 while some are already taking applications for fall 2023 and all of that might close very soon so i'll try my best guys to update you on so many schools that are offering uh, waivers offering admission offering scholarships and funding that you need to take advantage of this season so stay plugged to the family and guys now let's go check out the schools that I have for you today. So let's look at uh, University of California in Los Angeles. This university is a public land grant research university in Los Angeles. Currently now GRE is waived and also they offer funding up to $54,000 per year. Some of the scholarships and funding opportunities are closing in the month of October. That is why I'm bringing this to you now so that you can, uh, you know, quickly check them out and apply to them. Some are closing in November, some are closing in December, but I would advise that you start early so that you can take advantage of the ones that are still available. They have different amounts, so I'll put the link for you to check the page for the funding and everything in the description box. So ensure that you check that out. Let's go to the next university I'll be sharing with you for today. So this next university is a top-ranked public university in the United States, and that is the University of Michigan in Ann Arbor. This university offers guaranteed full funding for PhD students for the duration of their program. So that is guaranteed funding. Right now, the applications are open and application for PhD will be closing by December 15th. For master's degree program, the application closes by January 15th of next year. So they're already currently taking, they're already taking applications for fall 2023 admission. So take advantage of this guys. GRE is not required. GRE is totally waived. So I'll also leave the link to this code down below. For master's level uh, student, they also offer GR, they offer graduate assistance and uh, other assistance opportunities for you to have your tuition fee support. This this next one is for those who are interested in studying engineering and that is at the Penn State College of Engineering. This school offers engineering courses at graduate level and undergraduate level. They have an application fee guys. There's no application with fee waiver. However, they have some good packages. Like for undergrad level, they have scholarship available. For graduate level also, they have uh, funding opportunities such as graduate assistantship. Your graduate assistantship comes with tuition remission. That is, uh, you don't need to pay tuition. You have a uh, stipend and you also get some subsidy for medical insurance for me that is a good bargain guys medical insurance in the united states is a whooping amount of money i remember during my study i paid two thousand dollars for a semester for medical insurance and it is very very compulsory you need to pay it as an international student so you are getting some subsidy for that which really makes a lot of sense so uh, the application fee actually for graduates so i think it's like 65 dollars so if you can raise that for what you'll be getting and also the learning that you would be getting it's a top ranked school top rank in engineering school in the united states i think it is worth the bargain right now they are still taking applications for winter and fall yeah winter application will be closing by august 15th uh, october 15th so you still have time to apply or you can just be patient and apply for fall 
uh, next year which will be closing i think later in december just confirm that on the page gre is not required gre is not required so for engineering student that is a big deal do ensure that you check out the school this next school is a public research university in atlanta and it has an acceptance rate of 82 percent so that means a higher chance of being offered admission at this school gre is program specific some courses require some courses don't require there are some courses i checked for they don't require it like computer science doesn't require gre so, and they also offer programs like nursing doctor of nursing hiring they have masters of nursing program health management health administration health informatics so for all of you that are interested in health related courses this school has opportunity for you to come in and also they have a funding database that you can explore they have so many types of funding available so I, you cannot really specifically say that oh this is their uh, scholarship program you need to take notes of some of the ones that are available to apply for them so i'll also leave the link for this school for you to check out this school it is the georgia state university in atlanta georgia guys let me tell you about michigan technological university this university has an acceptance rate of 70 percent and do you know the beautiful thing about this school no application fees required unofficial transcript is accepted no gre and what more full tuition is available full tuition waiver is available if you work full-time full-time as a graduate student is you working 20 hours per week which most international students do so if you get a job offer to work 20 hours per week guaranteed no tuition and you also get and you also get a monthly stipend at the minimum stipend rate so for me this is a win-win for you. you guys jump on this school no application fees required at all no application fees required just fill out the online application submit your university transcripts you don't need to evaluate it you don't need to guys you should definitely check out this next university it is the southwestern university it's a private uh, liberal arts college in georgetown texas with an acceptance rate of 49 percent so it's majorly for those that are interested in undergraduate studies and they offer offer merit-based scholarships for undergraduate students including international students they don't do need-based scholarships they majorly do merit-based that is they evaluate your application and the thing is you don't need to apply separately for their scholarship you are evaluated at the time of admission so they consider your ad, ad, they, so they consider your application all the things that you have submitted like your essays and the rest to consider you for funding and also there is no application fee so you can definitely try out this school to see if you get funding or not because now there's nothing to lose you are basically not paying any money to apply to the school so southwestern university also offer work study opportunities for undergraduate students as part of their financial package so this is definitely a school you should check out guys this yes. next university is a private co-ed catholic institution and that is annie maria college they offer programs at the undergraduate level and the graduate level so for undergrad they actually receive applications via common app if you guys know common app or via the online uh, portal there's an application fee and based on what i've checked there's no application fee waiver however they have work study opportunity available for undergraduate they have a merit-based scholarship that is ranging from 18,500 to like 24,500 for international students so take advantage of this for undergraduate studies also at the graduate level they offer uh, graduate assistant they offer different forms of scholarship as well and gpa of 2.7 from your undergrad is accepted so if you have a gp of 2.7 you can totally apply to this school and then you would uh, be sure that you'll be offered the admission the beautiful thing about this next school is that they do not require an application fee that is zero dollar application fee and that is at the usc marshall school of business this is the school of business for the university of southern california and also gre or gmat tests can be waived so you need to request for a waiver of the steps and the requirements to do this are on the website as well also they have some need no not need based so they have merit based scholarship opportunities available so you should check that out as well on their university page so usc marshall has different rounds of application deadline they have one uh, closing on october 15 another in december but i would uh, i would advise that you apply as early as you can basically so that you can be considered for scholarship this next university is a women's university in massachusetts meaning that only women are accepted to this school 
and they have undergraduate and graduate courses at undergraduate level SAT ACT are optional right now and there is no application fee for undergraduate level they have a number of courses and it is advisor for you to qualify for the scholarship and financial uh, aid you need to apply by the published deadline so I uh, ensure that you apply early they have like three different rounds of admission deadline so ensure that you check them out and apply by those days if you want to enjoy scholarship opportunities at the graduate level as well there depends on the depending on the course there are some application fees that you will need to pay and i try to check for application fee waivers for those courses i don't think that they have but do check that out as well confirm but however the beautiful thing is that on uh, for graduate level as a woman you know this school is basically for women uh, you don't have to pay tuition if you get a uh, graduate fellowship so they give graduate assistance fellowship opportunities and with that you get full tuition you get monthly stipend so this school is really a good opportunity for you do check out the school as well this next university i'll be sharing with you is the university of rochester in new york this university is a private research university and they offer programs in medicine, nursing, business, a wide range of courses at both undergraduate and master and graduate level. Uh, for PhD students, if you apply by the deadline date, the application fee is automatically waived. However, for other categories of students, you can apply for a fee waiver. You need to fill a form on the university's website. So fill out that form to get uh, your application fees waived. Also, they have a number of scholarship opportunities available for international students. Some of their some of their scholarship range from like two thousand dollars to like full tuition. So do check out this school to see the course that you're interested in and also read the full requirements for your course. Yes. So these are all the schools that I have to share with you today, guys. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. Please let me know what you would like me to share next time. The kind of information that you require, what you would like to know. Please leave me some comment down below, and I'll definitely shoot another video to discuss whatever it is that you want thank you so much guys until i come your way again next time do take care and all the best to you in your school search and funding applications bye